This is Digital Byte Computing. I'm going to show you how to copy some files to a data store in your uh, VMware vSphere environment. So we can copy an ISO for example so that you can mount the ISO and boot a uh, virtual machine. You can boot the ISO with Windows or Linux. You can copy other files and you can actually store a whole heap of stuff inside a data store as opposed to somewhere else on another hard drive or server. So you can do this on vSphere connecting directly to an ESX host, ESXi host, or you can do it via vCenter as well uh, and, and do it across multiple hosts if you want to as well. Simple steps is you select your host, make sure you're in host view um, or in, in my case inventory if I'm connecting directly into a host. Click on configuration. In Under hardware, we want to select storage. You'll see that I've got a couple of data stores already configured. So I'm going to select this data store, for example. I'm going to right click on it, say browse data store. And then I select a location that I want to copy some files to. So I'm going to create a new folder, we'll call it ISOs and OK. Select that folder. Click on upload file. You can upload a file or a folder. And we've got an ISO that I've navigated to. This is a CentOS 7 ISO and open. And that is going to start to copy that ISO into that particular data store. So then I can actually mount um, that ISO when I want to create a new virtual machine, which is makes it very, very easily. So that is pretty much it. Once it's in there, you can then go and download it off the data store onto your computer. This is also a handy way to say back up a virtual machine if you need to. You can copy the VMDK files uh, and you can also just delete the stuff in there as well. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for a whole bunch of more videos.